title of my musical is, oh, I can speak. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's More Trees, Please. By the time this Toastmasters meeting is over, a chunk of rainforest the size of more than 3,000 football fields will be destroyed. Thousands of acres of ancient rainforest and its creatures every hour. This is happening in many parts of the world. Indonesia, Malaysia, Africa, the Amazon, and our trees, the very lungs of our planet, are being slashed and burned because of the diabolical demand for timber, palm oil, and soybeans. When I first became aware of this environmental devastation, I have to admit, I lost sleep over it. I'm really fond of trees. How about you? Are you fond of trees? Yes. 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 So I kept thinking, how can I serve the trees? How can I serve the trees? And the vision came to me. Create an Earth Day movement that will engage a million or more individuals around the world and have them plant a tree pose, which is a yoga pose, and raise more than a million dollars to plant trees all over the globe. My mission is to raise money and awareness to, uh, about this deforestation. And I try to make it as simple as possible so that I can engage people. And here's how it works. You go to plantatreepost.com and join the movement. Then you donate a dollar, just one buck, or more if you want, to your choice of tree planting nonprofits. I am working with Earth Day Network, Trees for the Future, and Project Green Hands. Then you upload a photo of yourself doing the tree pose. And the cool thing about the photo, it is going to be part of a giant photo mosaic that is going to be a spectacular art exhibit in New York City for Earth Day 2016. Does that sound good? Yes. yes. You like it? Yes. yes. Well, now that I have you rooting for the trees, <laughs> I want to sprout you into action. <laughs> so I want everyone to stand up because we're going to do a tree post now. And go ahead and stand behind your chairs. How many of you have ever done this yoga pose, a tree pose? Okay, some of you have. Good. Well, if you feel like you're going to be a little unsteady, it's quite okay to hold on to the edge of your chair. I want you to keep your eyes open, but find a point that you can focus on as I lead you through the tree pose. So let's go ahead and feel our feet. Feel them in your shoes. And now press them into the floor. Really root yourself to the floor. And as you do this, I want to, you to think of your favorite memory of trees. I mean, did you climb trees when you were a kid? Or maybe you like to swing from them, like Tarzan. Think of your memory with trees. And now I want you to take your right leg and bring, or foot, and bring it up to the lower part of your left leg. So right in the middle of your calf and have your knee come out to the side. If you need to hold on, it's okay. How many of you feel like you're swaying in the wind? Yes, that's quite all right. So hold it here. And now I want you to bring your palms together. And this is called prayer pose in yoga. And as you study yourself, I want you to Think of all the things you appreciate about trees. Is it their beauty? Or maybe how they give you shade on a hot day? Think about the forest. Is it their stillness? Or maybe it's the whispering musical that the wind creates through their branches. Feel the trees in your heart. 
And now, let's go ahead and reach up. Bring those limbs up over your head. And as we do this, I want you to think of how you can branch out and tell people about the movement. I want you to think of 10 family members and friends that you can tell about Plant a Tree Pose. Think of people you know all over the world and how you can share this with them on Facebook or Twitter. Awesome job, everyone. You can put your hands down and then stand. Go ahead and have a seat. Good job. I hope I have sown a seed in you to join the Plan to Tree Post movement and to share it with everybody. And I hope that you do it when it's fresh in your mind and heart. I know we get busy and we forget about things. That's our human nature, right? Well, I hope when you look at a tree, you remember Mother Nature. These trees, the rainforest, might not be in our own backyard, but they are the lungs of our only planet. Every hour, another load cut off. To breathe or not to breathe. To be or not to be. Our forests and climate are at a tipping point. The balance of these are at a tipping point. I urge you to join the movement and spread the message of more trees, please. Let's say it together. More, more trees, please. Thank you. <laughs>